And people often wonder whether we could harvest electrical power from lightning. On the face of it, it makes sense. After all, lightning is electricity and lightning strikes seem pretty powerful. The problem is a lightning strike is over so fast that the total amount of energy delivered isn't that extreme. And in any case, it's very hard to get lightning to strike where you want it. A typical lightning strike delivers enough energy to power a residential house for about two days. That means that even the Empire State Building, which is struck by lightning about 100 times a year, wouldn't be able to keep a house running on lightning power alone. Even in regions of the world uh, with a lot of lightning, such as Florida and the Eastern Congo rainforest, the power delivered to the ground by sunlight outweighs the power delivered by lightning by a factor of a million. Uh, this makes sense because ultimately lightning is still powered by sunlight. Like generating power from lightning is, is kind of like building a, uh, a wind turbine powered by tornadoes. Um, impractical, although that would also be very 